Hey guys, Cam here, and while Pokemon Go launched in the US, Australia, and New Zealand on the Play Store, those of us outside those countries haven't been able to download it from there. However, there is a way to get it, at least on Android. First, you have to make sure your phone allows downloads from any source by heading to Settings, then Security, then switch the Unknown Sources toggle to the On position. Once you've done that, you head to APK Mirror, where you can download the app's APK directly onto your phone. Now, I've left the link in the description box for that, so you can just go ahead and do that straight away. Now, once it's downloaded, you tap the notification card in the top, then hit Install, and the app will be installed on your phone within a few minutes as normal. As soon as it's installed, you can play the game just as you would if you downloaded it from the Play Store. Now when you first launch the game you'll go through a basic setup process where you choose your character's gender, hair, eyes, clothes, bag and all the rest of it before being sent to go find your first Pokemon. It's an AR game which means you actually have to get up off your chair, go outside and go find the closest Pokemon to you. Then you fling your Pokeball at them to capture them. They don't stay still, mind you, so it is a little bit tricky to begin with. Once you've caught one, though, you can create a nickname for yourself, and then you're ready to start your training, visit sites, and progress. The game will send you all the way around your local area to find different spots and other characters and gyms to train your character. Sadly for iPhone fans, there's no easy way to get it on an iOS device in the UK until next week, when it's expected to launch officially. Hope you found that useful. I've been Cam. I'm at Cam Bunton on Twitter. I'll see you again soon.